In Hot Friends, it's something that not many zoos offer to children. So get those resumes ready because the Henry Vilas Zoo is actually looking for high school and college students who want a unique place to work this summer. Here with the details is Lynn Curry, the Director of Volunteer Services for the Henry Vilas Zoo. And Lynn, thanks so much for getting up early with us this morning. Absolutely. We're glad to have the opportunity to tell everybody what's going on at the zoo this summer. Now, this may be a no-brainer, but what's it like working at the zoo? It's pretty fantastic, actually. <laughs> um, I'm the Director volunteer services so a lot of what I do is behind the scenes but I also have a chance to go out onto the zoo grounds multiple times a day to visit everybody and see how things are going obviously you see lots of shiny bright happy faces a lot of people excited to be at the zoo and enjoying their day and of course some glimpses of the animals and a chance to stop for a moment or two and watch the otters play or listen to the lion roar it's pretty amazing it's and it's a fun place to see the whole community out enjoying a beautiful day yeah that just sounds awesome Awesome. But what, what jobs are you looking to fill right now with this summer help you're trying to hire? Sure, sure. We have four positions available. Um, two of them are in our food services. We are offering line cook positions as well as front um, cashier positions as well. We have jobs in our gift shop, so keeping things stocked and selling products in each of our gift locations throughout the zoo. And then we have a new position this year, which is a guest services assistant. That's a person that you know, really needs to be very outgoing. They're going to be out on the zoo grounds, walking around, visiting with guests, having a chance to really tell the guests different ways that they can support the zoo and be a part of what we're doing to keep the zoo strong. Fantastic. Now, when it comes to hiring and applying mm -hmm. for jobs, everybody at home is going to want to know what's sure. the pay like and what are those hours like? Absolutely. The pay is $9 an hour, so we um, are, are looking to kind of bring some new folks in that maybe haven't looked at the zoo before. Um, the hours are going to vary. We are open every day of the year, so all summer long, um, and we are open from 9.30 to 5, so the hours vary within that. We're looking for people who are willing to work those weekend hours because those are definitely our busiest days of the week. So some flexibility and some willingness to kind of shift around to make sure we get all those spots filled with everyone. And I think flexibility is key, especially for high school and college students, because a lot Absolutely. of times they're involved in a lot of extracurriculars or sports and things like that. So exactly. you're willing to work around that. Absolutely. That flexibility goes both ways, for sure. Fantastic. Well, you guys have a great event today to help mm -hmm. get those applications in, the resumes going, and yep. talking with the people at the zoo. Mm -hmm. So tell us a little bit about that. Well, we're excited to be partnering with the Urban League this year, um, because we really are. We're so fortunate to be a community-supported zoo nestled in the middle of the city and so we really want to be an integral part um, of the community as a whole we draw people from throughout the community and so to be able to partner with Park Street and to be able to partner with Urban League to to get the word out there is great we'll be having a job fair today there at the Urban League on South Park from 2 to 5 so we'll have our management staff there accepting applications and talking to people who are interested in any of those four positions so we're, we're talking about this pretty early in this in the morning so you've got a couple hours to Absolutely. get things put together yep. in case you're not ready yep. but what should people bring along with them to this job event it would be great to have some sense of what your schedule is going to be for the summer maybe some time frames that you would prefer to work um, some date ranges maybe when you are planning to be out of town um, definitely bring your list of job experiences the date ranges that you've worked and a couple of references so that you can put those on the application we'll have application forms there with us you can fill them out there you can also go on to our website ahead of time if you want to be an overachiever print those out and fill them out and then bring them along with you to hand to the staff when you now, see them now just quickly because we're running out of time here sure. but you know obviously this is happening today so again right. we only have a few hours to get things ready can people still apply even after today absolutely we'll have those links available on our website vilaszoo.org so that they go on, go on the website look under the employment section and be able to click right through to that information all right lynn thanks so much and again we will have those links a little bit later this morning they're not up just yet but check back a little later at nbc15.com and we'll have all that available for you at that home. sounds good thank you so much Lynn, for giving thanks us the time so much to be for here. coming in we appreciate it absolutely we're going to send things up